Okay, for sneaky thumb on page 68, the first thing you'll need is to find F and C. F is right here next to the three black keys, and C is right here next to the two black keys. First, she'll take her left hand and sneak her thumb onto C like this on its side. Then she can open up the rest of her hand and lay her fingers down on the keys next to C like this, and they should be kind of rounded, kind of curved. Then for the right hand, she'll sneak the thumb onto F and then open her hand up and lay the fingers on the keys. And you'll want to make sure that she doesn't have two fingers on one key. It should be one finger per key. And once she's in that position, then she's ready to play the Birthday Train song, which is on the next page on 69. And Birthday Train starts out with the right hand. We know it's right hand because it has treble clef and because the notes are above the words. And it's going to go F, F, G, A, A, G, F, F, C, C, F, 2, 3, 4. Then there are repeat dots, so we do that line again. F, F, G, A, A, G, F, F, C, C, F, 2, 3, 4. Then at the end, there are two notes for the right hand to play at the same time. This is going to be the one finger and the four finger on the right hand, and they play F and B. And it'll go one, two, one, two, one, two, three, four. Then there's a rainbow in the book, and that means we go up higher. She'll rainbow up to the next F and sneak the thumb and do the whole thing again. And then it's one and four together again. One, two, one, two. One, two, three, four. And that's the end of the birthday train song.